And we're back for the final stretch of Mass Effect 2. Yay! Uh, technical difficulties aside... Let's, shit. Yeah. Let's just focus on the post-game and not the technical difficulties we may or may not have encountered. Commander, you've received a new message at your private... We totally team. haven't done this for the uh, least one time Incoming before. message from Admiral Seriously. Stephen Hack at Alliance HQ. Commander Shepard, I need to discuss a sensitive matter with you privately. I'll take this in my quarters. So let's get right on it. We did have all the stuff with that in recorded, right? No. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, okay. He's making sure that part's very important. Should be. Commander. I'll look later. Thank you for your time. I'll keep this brief. We have a deep cover operative out in Batarian space. Name's Dr. Amanda Kenson. Dr. Kenson recently reported that she found evidence of an imminent Reaper invasion. So why call me? No, Just this cool. morning I received word that the Batarians <laughs> arrested her. Or secret cook, I guess. Her a secret prison outpost on terrorism charges. I need you to infiltrate the prison and get her out of there. As a favor to me, I'm asking you to go in alone. Why must I go alone? I have a hell of a squad. I'm sure they'd help out. Jensen is my friend. If the Batarians see a squad of armed soldiers, they'll kill her. This is serious, Commander. Go in with discretion, or don't go at all. Fair enough. I thought the Alliance denies the Reaper threat. That must be some proof she found. Kenson's team found an artifact out in Batarian space. She believes it's a Reaper device, proof that the Reapers are indeed planning to invade. I've known her a long time. If she says she has proof, it's worth checking out. Fine. This is probably going to go horribly, but fine. I'll make this a priority. The prison is it's a mission for us, of course it's going to go horribly. <laughs> I'll upload the coordinates now. So of course they're going out without backup. Yeah. Confirm her discovery. We'll debrief you when you're back. Got it. Like, you'd think we'd be able to at least, you know, have our allies waiting in the orbit or something. I mean, normally stealth drive is top notch, so as long as uh, we stay at the visual yeah. range, no we're good. You, I, think we'd, you think we'd be able to bring them ready to assist as soon as we. <laughs> Yeah. A whole bunch of random stuff that's not as important. <coughs> I was like, this time I will try to remember to not stop and pick up every single pickup along the way. Because <laughs> you know, there's literally no point. Yeah. Blah blah blah. Shitty, tr uh, shitty, gar uh, shitty world full of Batarians. You're free to pass and read it if you want. None of it's important. Not really, but hey, Lord is Lord. Okay, so I'm going to bring a bit more appropriate weapon. Could bring that. <laughs> sure. I don't know. I don't know how much ammo it eats. Grenade launcher is probably a better bet. It's just a boarding bet. I'm actually going to cut down to the Carnifex. <gasps> I mean, remember to refire rate on this sucker. Fair enough. Everything else is good. Like, straight up, can't get two shots off during an adrenaline rush. And it's kind of silly. But again, you're mostly supposed to use rapid fire weapons since it during that. I'll just let myself in. I know what he does. Yeah, that's much faster. Actually wasting ammo just to check. Eh, that's acting enough for it too. I don't know, you don't seem to have that many pieces of them. That oh, we can check. Baron. The Batarians must send their prisoners down here to die. I have to find Dr. Kenson now. Eh, it's no big deal. 
no big deal at all. This place is run down, even for a prison. Into this prison. Uh, you think even the Batarians wouldn't want to keep their prison full of holes? Take your hand off me. Did you go the wrong way? This looks important. I guess that would do it. The fact that I don't hear all this coming their way is kind of sad. Yeah, but then it's, uh... Perception's a dump stat for them. So you would seem. I hear humans are scurrying like a asteroid belt. Is anywhere safe from them? We should arm a mission to flush them all out. This would have been useful, you know, two missions ago. Yeah, something like that. Uh, is this really a dead end? Am I dumb? I might be dumb. I don't know, but it's lower. Mm -hmm. Let's go this We've way. heard it before, bro. You are sad, I guess. Mystery of also played the game before, but uh, you know, this is the point. Don't think about it too hard. What difference does it make? We call them. It's like just a wee bit extreme. Anytime you I'm not sure they had their good reasons for them. Sure. They're creepers. That is what we call the Godzilla threshold. Exactly. Now let's see if this is any better than what we're Hey, I got two shots off. Four shots off. Yeah, just barely. Now I recommend such a weapon so hey, you pick up some ammo. Yeah, enemies drop ammo. Yeah, I mean, fair. Why did I grab that? Well, likely the ammo that you used. I think. Eh, details, details. Details, details, details. Well said. Maybe she's hard. We ain't getting damaged, much less destroyed. No humans will do anything to destroy, but swear. We have to make this one an example to the other. We can't respond kindly to terrorists. Oh, the irony, right? Right. Wow. That first one didn't count. So, Sandy. Listen, we've established my mouse has um, issues. Did you pass me for something? Pretty much, yeah. Yay, that's our way out. Is that convenient of it? It's not an entirely sure what's the point on the sound that good. I already forgot what you did with it last time. Well, all I did last time was move it. Now I'm actually gonna see if I can manipulate it. Just because I'm curious. Can. Hmm. I have no idea what it does. It 
There was even loot inside or something. I have no fucking idea. Oh, there yeah. Yeah, even loot. Now what's this? I don't know. Or, well... Upgrade that we basically can't really get any use out of. Well, now you know. How about that? Things that only that only makes sense because I have way too much meta knowledge. Shush. Received my message. We're not safe here. Can you walk? I'm fine. Just give me a moment. We have to go. Now. If we can find a console, I can hack security. Make us an escape path. Then we'll find one. Go. Ready. Commander Shepard is a master of getting in and out of cover, apparently. So you would say. Also, you have to wonder about the effectiveness of the rest restraints in the Mass Effect world. If it's that easy for someone to get out of them. And like, admittedly, you still don't love them, but it still can. Uh... Cyberbomb and uh, hacking brain chips, so she could have just gotten out by her own cells. Probably? Question mark? It's like, look at the console, open the handcuffs, just pull herself out. Because apparently she can just do them. They know we're here. Keep them off me while I hack the way out. Surprise the team to self lock now. Now that I actually remember what's going on here. Yeah, I guess it's a bit easier to do when you've already done it. We need to go to the door we came in through. Keep them out. Shut they're up. coming up. They're coming through that door. Other side. Go. To be fair, I've done this a couple, at least three or four times before. Okay. Okay. When you've done it recently. There you go. It's relatively fresh in my mind. Still need more time. Hi there. Coming down their orbital tracking network. Watch the other side. More enemies on the elevators. Elevator that leads up to I'll bring it down to us. Almost done. Very effective, that was. <laughs> that did it. Let's move. Oh, that's so satisfying to do stuff like that. That's what I know to be prove easier said than done. Oh, one last thing. The hangar doors are hard locked. 
We'll have to get those open the old-fashioned way. Leave that to me. They're here! What even was the point of that? Uh... That scene? Burn! Never <gasps> mind, I'm busy. I love having so much ammo and nothing hurts. Fine, I'll cut through the lot of ya. Gotcha. You know, the guys of intelligence of the Vatarian military to walk across an automatic weapons field of fire while it's firing. I just wonder how they've lasted this long. Right. Remember, this is a covert mission. So, I, mean, I guess it's not very covert once you actually, once you already completed your objective. I was referring to the fact that the answer to everything was a light machine gun. <laughs> Engaging autopilot. Fair enough. We should be well out of range before they get their security measures unscrambled. Do you think they'll come after you? I'm not taking any chances. Batarians don't take kindly to humans who plan to destroy their mass relays. So the charges against you are true? Well, to be fair, that's about half the story. My people and I were here investigating rumors of Reaper technology out in the fringes of this system. I guess you found something. We found proof that the Reapers will be arriving in this system. When they get here, They'll use its mass relay to travel throughout the galaxy. We call it the Alpha Relay. From here, the Reapers can invade anywhere in the galaxy. So you decided to destroy it? Exactly. Doing that would stop the Reapers' invasion. Even at FTL speeds, it'd be months or years before they got to the next relay. We came up with what we just called the Project. A plan to launch a nearby asteroid into the relay and destroy it before the Reapers could arrive. Of course, the resulting explosion would probably wipe out the system. Yeah, I'm mean, reaching for the nuclear option there. Yeah. And to make sure it's cl it's clarified, uh, when she says reach anywhere in the galaxy, she basically means that, that relay, when a Reaper uses it, can connect to every other relay instead of a handful. Like yeah, that's uh, it's like a, that's a problem. To be able to attack literally everywhere at the once. Yeah, but no. Is the project still operational? I I imagine it is. We were one button press away from launch when the Batarians arrested me. Why do you think destroying the mass relay would destroy the entire system? Mass relays are the most You'd think that if they only had the a rest of the they could have the just, you know, pressed the button. Would probably you think? resemble a supernova. This is a remote system. But just over 300,000 Batarians live on the colony where they held us. The explosion would undoubtedly kill them all. I still don't see how you learned about this supposed invasion. The evidence came from what we call Object Row, a Reaper artifact we discovered among the asteroids near the relay itself. When we get back to Arctura Station, I'll explain everything and provide copies of all our notes on the artifact. Mm, I'd like to see this for myself. The stakes are too high. Yep. If you were willing to destroy a whole system over this, I want to see your proof. I guess I can't argue with that. Give me a moment. Kenson to Project Base. Affirmative. And I've got Commander Shepard with me. Tidy up the lab. The Commander needs to confirm the artifact. All set. Just sit back and relax. We'll be there in no time. Well, at least unlike the last DLC character, she doesn't spend half the DLC casting sideways glances at us and being clearly evil. 
looking at yeah. you, looking at you, a sorry specter. How long did it tell to, t to figure out? How long did it take to tell that Talavasir is going to betray you? All of three seconds into her first appearance. Here we you are. You know, I don't remember Welcome everyone. Welcome to Project Base. <laughs> exactly. What's this? That's our countdown to arrival. When that gets to zero, the Reapers will have come. Just over two days and counting. Puts things in perspective, doesn't it? How do you know that's an accurate countdown? It is. The artifact has been giving off pulses at definite intervals since we found it. The intervals have been decreasing at a steady rate. The artifact is reacting to the Reaper's proximity. In just over 48 hours, the pulses will become constant, and the Reapers will be here. I find it kind of funny that they just leave a, uh, a, um... A doomsday timer. Ba yeah, basically a doomsday timer. The could be at Earth in two days? There's no time to waste. Then let's show you that proof. That door exits the hangar. The artifact is in our central lab area. Go through the door at the end of that corridor to your left. Left. I totally didn't get go right the first time. So okay. listen. So what would it mean to get the project back up and running? Isn't it not really natural to go the opposite direction then? <laughs> it wasn't a question of could we, but should we? What alternative do we have? The Reapers will reach this system regardless, but the Alpha Relay is their shortcut to the rest of the galaxy. If you want to keep the Reapers at bay, this relay must be destroyed. This is the part where you ask something silly about, uh, couldn't we do something to keep the Reapers out of the relay? And then I said, who built the relays? <laughs> and you had your O oh moment. Yeah. We have to get the project running again. It's probably the only chance we have. One sec. Let me get the door. There could probably be some way. It's like, yep. That's weird looking. Commander Shepard. I give you object row. You have the Reaper artifact just sitting here? Out in the open? When we found it, it showed me a vision of the Reaper's arrival. Kenson, this is not good. Give it a moment, Shepard. It'll give you the proof you need. You start the project, Shepard. I can't let you stop the arrival. Shepard, also a master at being played. <coughs> Seriously. Take him down! Also letting in a missile. Is it also missing right. easy shots? Which makes sense, I'm playing him. And you, and you know. Not the best training here when he put out. He literally grabbed her hand and then just let her go. I think he, I think that was just he was trying to disarm her, and then once you know they started coming at him and opening fire, he needed to find cover. Do not resist. Give yourself over and be spared. Most you've seen me use a sniper rifle this entire game. Pretty much. Actually, we get to the next game, that's basically all I use sometimes. Okay. No more sniper rifles. Being done in this. You know, y'all are close and awful close to each other. Did, did it just clip through the... It's a tr it, The grenades track. Shows how much I've used that gun. Yep. Why would you use anything but the gun? Because it basically eats your entire ammunition stock in a single shot. I mean, if you, if you have a unit to look at this one, before you would have had two shots. Yeah, I guess. 
hurts a little. How about we not? God, I would love to have a, a throwable grenade right now. That's a flashbang. You're bringing out bigger guns? Finally, I thought y'all were never gonna take me seriously. Ow. I meant to do that. Why didn't you drop ammo, you asshole? Ammo. Just that drunk jump from zero to 200 rounds of reserve ammunition. It's only a matter of time. Struggle if you wish. Your mind will be mine. Okay, where's the Ymir? I got the grenade launcher. R really? Okay. Ymir isn't working. But not Ymir. Grenade launcher is not working. <laughs> so watch the switch. When all you have is a hammer, everything starts to look like a nail. Yep. I hate flash rings. Now, grenade will probably actually go some damage. Can grenade launcher make up its mind how it works? Now I know why I never use this gun. Fuck off! Oh, it's over there. I didn't need it anyway. It's fine. It's fine. Take him to the med bay and patch him up. We want Shepard alive. Are you sure about that? With taking I mean, Shepard alive, that's like the worst thing you could do. Right? I mean, the Reaper apparently wants us to be the first to witness the doom of humanity or whatever. But the Reaper clearly doesn't have enough information about us. Security! It's like, remember way back at the beginning of the game when Miranda had to give us a double dose of sedatives? Yeah. All those augments are paying off, huh? Step away from the damage. It's almost like she's telling us how to release. Something helpful. Literally two hours left. 
Hey, what's this over here? Shepard has been sedated constantly for two days now. We've had to increase each dosage. It seemed like Shepard was waking up a moment ago, but it could be a glitch in the system. No glitch. <laughs> the sedatives aren't working. Yeah, Otto's augments basically cause, cause Shepard to get increasing immunity to something as he's exposed to it. Makes sense. It's like when we went to Omega and a Batarian bartender tried to, tried to poison us. All it did was knock us out for a little while. I mean, humans normally get increasing immunity and come to chemical control. Yes, after long term yeah. exposure. <laughs> Yeah, they almost just make it happen faster. Way Was faster. I supposed to feel bad for killing them just because they had a name? You clearly never played Yakuza. Or you know, a few things that I do with this one. Oh, you poor naive fool. One does not sense me. Stop, Shepard. <laughs> of course not. That's what barrier is for. I didn't even need to use barrier for that, thank you. Fair enough. I probably should have just have been safe. But we know I'm, I don't exactly make good decisions. Mm -hmm. Well, you know. I do not appreciate you sealing that door. You know, next to You are excused from playing that we're duty. You are so excused from life duty. Or someone who's literally already dead. Just the bank line being used anyway. Pretty much. Keep pushing. Because that's a great angle to try and use a sniper rifle at, right? Oh, Ow. That's annoying. Did I mention I hit flashbangs? I hit flash bangs. Denied. Assuming it charges fast enough. Mistakes might have been made here. Okay, we're good. Combat rule number I don't fuck, I'm not counting. Don't stand near buddy with the fuel tank. Or should I say, don't stand near the idiot who, who, has a, who has a flame or fuel tank. This is immediately following the, the previous rule. Don't stand by the idiot, don't be the idiot carrying a fuel tank. Welcome to <laughs> I want to activate the project. Warning, activating the project results in an estimated 305,000 casualties. Do you wish to continue? I mean, the alternative is, you know, the entire galaxy. So, yes.
Alert. All colonists living in the Bahak system. This is... Shepard, no! Do you have any idea what you've done? Oh, I tried. You leave me no choice. If we can't stop this asteroid, it must be destroyed. Tell me where to find Dr. Amanda Kenson. Dr. Kenson is traveling to the reactor core module. An ESO core meltdown should do it. Because of you, everyone on this rock will be obliterated. Not if I get to you first. Thank you for telling me where you are. Pretty much. Chase her down. Why does it always give uh, give us a submachine gun? We, our class can't even equip that. Don't try to stop me, Shepard. I have to do this. I've already activated the project. We can still escape this rock. There is no escape. There's no redemption for what you've done. I will die, never having seen the Reaper's blessings. And you will just die. Damn it, Kenson. Interesting definition of the phrase trapped. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that means what you think it means. Okay, that hurt. So it seems. That hurt him more. They say cranium crotch center of mass. How do I stabilize the reactor core? All automatic safety protocols have been overridden to stabilize the reactor core. Manually insert cooling rod A from this control station. Manually insert cooling rod B from control station B. Doing so will stabilize the reactor. Core. I get the feeling it should be a lot more complicated than just push uh, push a cylinder into a console. But, uh, okay. Mm, I guess it depends on how it was David. I mean, how it was this David. Be stabilized. Yeah, that. You know, personally, I think any reactor core design that can be, for one thing, manually destabilized so easily, it's kind of stupid. Yeah, well, she did kind of have full control. But why was it designed to be to be that easy to destabilize? Like, why would you do that? They were kind of in a hurry. Do not stand by your buddy with the, with the, with the explosive fuel pack. Aw, oh, he didn't explode. Oh uh, no, it was doing its job just fine. I mean, I guess it just have some glass, it just didn't do glass. Just die. Up we go. Interesting definition of locked in, buddy. You've been better off using the door shut. Shit, 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 barrier. I hate playing doors. Well, that takes care of that. I am kind of amused how they call each other by name, but when you look at them, they never actually have a name. Of course, what do they matter? 
they're dead meat. Mm-hmm. At least you Echo was consistent with it. <laughs> Like anyone even cares about the names, so I'll accept a few Are you sure? I noticed a lot of named characters are simply referred to as menacing man who were, who promptly got their spine broken by a bicycle. Yeah, I was referring to, you know uh Kibusau. Uh, you know, the actual main story ones. Right. Yeah, but these aren't main story ones, they're mooks. Exactly. Yeah, you know, they did try to refer to them by name to make you feel bad for some reason. Yeah, it didn't work. All I did was make me feel vindicated as I snapped her fucking spine for daring to try to start shit with me. Oh no. Oh no? There's a 40k mobile game. You just now found it out? Yeah. I've known about that I'm for a while. I'm a bit concerned. How bad is it? Uh, I didn't, didn't even pay attention to it because it's a mobile game, so therefore I don't care. I don't know. Well, I'm probably going to be very bored when I'm the next week, so I guess I'll try it out sometime during that time. Try to stop me! Okay. Step away from the reactor. You ruined everything. I can't hear the anymore. Turn away. You have successfully tried. You've taken them away from me. I will never see the Weeper's arrival. All you had to do was stay. With that. All I had to do was that, right from the start. Mm-hmm. Bollocks. <coughs> Warning. Collision imminent. Warning. Warning. Collision imminent. Warning. Get the fuck out of here. That's our footy. Get the F we went from two hours to uh Joker, even this is Shepard. I need a pickup. Now communication system damaged. Damn it. Evacuation protocols in effect. All personnel report to escape shuttles. Where can I find All escape one personnel remaining? Take the lift from this route to the external access. Thirty minutes. That's right, that's 30 minutes until the Reapers arrive. Yeah. I have to get to that comm tower and take a shuttle. It's my only chance. We can deny this, Shepard. You don't need to monologue on yourself, let's just go. <laughs> what, you don't monologue yourself? No, I just talk to my other self since then. Oh. But I do that mentally while doing other stuff. I don't just stand there talking to myself about it. Especially when I'm in a hurry. <laughs> you know, it really looks kind of pretty. But it's a little close for my taste. Watch the really just catch the asteroid and send it like any other ship. <laughs> Everything for nothing. I did, that's why I turned my camera away. It went right over your COVID. Well, somebody's decided to get the hell out of Dodge. So it would seem. Get past that first. Oh, 
Oh yeah, at least the robot's dead. Okay. I couldn't tell if I finished it off. I could. Yeah. It went off exploding at the same time as the grenade. First I stayed in the dashboard, but anyway. It was so well timed, I almost didn't realize that it was a flash fire. It was a the weird images on top. Tom Tower. Tom Tower. Comrade. And this was all we missed last time. Shepard that was it. Joker, do you read me? Wow. We somehow managed to crash, like. Right at the end. Dear yeah, like. 30 seconds. Uh, and hello. Shepard, 30 seconds and I've got some annoyance. You find no shit. this inevitability. Dust struggling against cosmic winds. This seems a victory to you. A star system sacrificed. But even now, your greatest civilizations are doomed to fall. Your leaders will beg to serve us. This is a warning shot. <laughs> hmm. Some humans are afraid that the Reapers are too powerful. But when the Alpha Relay breaks, everyone will see that we can fight the Reapers. And win. However insignificant we might be. We will fight. We will sacrifice. And we will find a way. That's what humans do. Know this as you die in vain. Your time will come. Your species will fall. Prepare yourselves for the arrival. Shepard, Normandy, inbound for pickup. Roger that. Nice of them to come get me. Alright, best helmsman in the galaxy. How about another harrowing jump? Get us out of here, Joker. He's awful calm about it, isn't he? He's probably more like concentrated. He is in the zone, as they say. This is the use there, really, right before he gets fucking smashed. Yeah, I don't think he can pass with that. But that might be a, a tiny bit too big for the racing. I didn't realize just how much he is. That, that will do it. Big enough rock can destroy anything, huh? Pretty much. I like that. We just committed a massive atrocity in the name of survival. Yeah, that's. Other <sighs> cities. Looks like you've recovered. Admiral Hackett. Sounds like you went through hell down there. How are you feeling? Fine. No more visions, if that's what you mean. I wasn't expecting to see you here. You went out there as a favor to me. I decided to debrief you in person. That was before the mass relay exploded and destroyed an entire Batarian system. What the hell happened out there, Commander? Have you received any intel about what happened? All I know is I sent you out there to break Amanda Kenson out of prison. And now an entire system is destroyed. I hope you could fill in the leap of logic between those two events. I confirmed Dr. Kenson's proof. The Reapers were coming, and destroying that relay was the only way to stop them. Kenson sedated me for almost them, two but... days. I started the engines with little more than an hour left. I tried to warn the Batarian colony, but time ran out. The Batarians report no survivors from Aratat. At least you tried. And you believe the Reaper invasion really was a threat? No doubt about it. We literally had minutes to spare. I'm sure all the details are in your report. 
I won't lie to you, Shepard. The Batarians will want blood, and there's just enough evidence for a witch hunt. And we don't want war with the Batarians, not with the Reapers at the galaxy's edge. What are you saying? You did what you did for the best of reasons, but there were more than 300,000 Batarians in that system, all dead. They died to save trillions of lives. If I could have saved them, you bet your ass I would have. You're preaching to the choir, Commander. If it were up to me, I'd give you a damn medal. Unfortunately, not everyone will see it that way. So what do you suggest? Evidence against you is shoddy at best. But at some point, you'll have to go to Earth and face the music. I can't stop it. But I can and will make them fight for it. Is the Alliance concerned about the Batarians' response to this incident? Very. The Batarians have been looking for an excuse to wage war on us since we showed up in the galaxy. If the Reapers invade, we need the galaxy to work together. If we're at war with the Batarians, the other races will be hesitant to give aid to either side. Is the Alliance prepared for a Reaper invasion? <coughs> no. That's hard to say. Fuck it no. took multiple fleets and the Destiny Ascension to bring Sovereign down. And that was just one Reaper. If the Reapers come in force, we're just not ready. I didn't expect to see you aboard a Cerberus vessel. I don't like Cerberus or the way they do things. But they brought you back to life. And they're actually doing something about the state of the galaxy. Besides, I'm not so yes. sure this is a Cerberus ship anymore. <laughs> Fair enough. It's kind of not. <laughs> Pretty much. I'll gladly stand trial once this mission is done. Glad to see working with Cerberus has stripped away your sense of honor. Yep. Do whatever you have to do out here. But when Earth calls, you make sure you're there with your dress blues on. Ready to take the hit. In the meantime, you keep this. I don't need to see a report to know you did the right thing. Yes, sir. You've done a hell of a thing, Commander. Doctor <laughs> wow. I know, right? Dr. Amanda Kenson rescued from Batarian prison on planet Eratot, and Shepard confirmed proof of a Reaper invasion. Shepard was captured by Kenson, who had been indoctrinated by a Reaper artifact. Shepard escaped and activated the project, destroying the Alpha Relay and ending the Reaper invasion. Dr. Kenson did not survive. Bahat Bahat's system and all its inhabitants were destroyed. Yeah. I won't exactly That's call that ends and the means, but is there any last bits? Nope. That's it. That is Mass Effect 2. So join us next time. Yep. Join us next time as we fin uh, hit, the, hit the final part of the trilogy. And the Reaper War. A.K.A. and kick some people's butt. Laters. Bye-bye.